And it's a shame because, like I said, they really are a first class drafter, you know, f- young free agent signer and developer of talent. And, like you just, you know, they, as, as good as they get, we know it's going to get stripped down in a couple of years after that. So it's, it's a shame. But, you know, and, and, and the, like I said, the division they're in, you got, you know, the Yankees and, and the Sox and, and sometimes the Jays spending crazy amounts of money. And now the Orioles are another team that's been bad for so long. They've been able to draft well and develop well. And, they're showing that this year. So it's the division is really rough. So, but yeah, nobody seems to care about the race. I mean, obviously the visiting fans have tickets available. If you want to take a small vacation to Tampa CP area, lots of stuff to do, but um, yeah. So today will be the, we're going to randomize for two boxes and we're going to break them together. So I'm going to do one random and then we're going to do another random same amount of dice rolls for each of them. We'll just do the number of dice rolls, five or more. And then we're going to random and then we'll do, um, actually, we'll just, yeah, we'll do random and then we'll do another random for the box after that. So, just to, to keep things keep things in the same as been. So, um, and like all the spots are sold. So, there's nothing out there that's that's unsold today. So, it's, you know, you guys, a lot of you guys got some good deals because the package, the two for one, basically on eBay and, uh, you know, bidding was, was relatively light on some stuff and pretty crazy on some stuff. So, it's, you know, like I said, I don't mind, like I said, the, the money wise, you guys you did a good job with the, you know, making sure all the spots are sold. So, you know, you know, looking forward to seeing somebody get a nice deal on whatever they hit tonight. So, um, so let's get that started. Like I said, I don't think I have anything else. Like I said, other than the, that framework box that's sitting there that will break on Wednesday. Um, we had a couple more spots um, grabbed today. I think there's uh, 17, I think, or 19, 17 or 19 empty. So you guys can go on the website and grab those they're eight dollars or two for 15 and then the you know it's 33 spots because there's 33 different jerseys on the checklist i don't know the ratios because you know that's i'm sure there's not five crosby's or maybe one crosby in 100 boxes but um if that randomizes comes to you on crosby and the hits it's yours so that's can't be that for 750 but like i said that's totally random um the spots you know the jerseys are all adidas except for the reebok mckinnon and you know, we had the, the Adidas Tuvo Terra Mining come out last time, so we know they're they're good looking jerseys. And like I said, if I have to eat any spots, you know, it'll be in one of the reloads of the jersey if it hits and it's mine. But um, I said they're there. I want you guys to buy the spots. I want you guys to hit the jerseys. It's you know, not something I bought for me to win, but you know, I definitely want you guys to to take a look at the the roster and see if there's stuff that you'd like to hit. And definitely, if you want to take a cheap shot, you know, take for fifteen is not too bad. Um, but other than that, like I said, we just have the PYP. I haven't ordered any hit parade boxes. Um, the new series 10 is out and available on their website. I may grab a couple of those. Um, a couple, of, I mean, it's a huge, huge partial checklist. I think that they were they got a lot of grief for not you know having enough partial players and for breakers using their product. We'd like to have a better idea of what's in there, even though the majority of them are still going to be customs. We know that, you know, what, you know, send five, 80 percent seem to be customs, but um, they do have some couple of nice headliners, you know, five, six, seven decent headliners that are nice hits. And then, you know, we know from their checklist which ones are, you know, probably licensed jerseys as opposed to, you know, the majority of them are customs. But we need to say that even the customs are nice if you just want to frame it up or if you want to, you know, obviously, if you want to have an autograph of some of the players, it's nice to have it even on a custom. Um, I was able to hit, you know, a couple customs this week, you know, the, you know, the break. So it's, you know, just, you're used to saying them. It's not, it's the, like I said, my customs, you know, like the ones I've hit actually are going to my boxes as bonus jerseys, you know, unlisted bonus jerseys. You guys benefit from me hitting these customs at other, other break rooms. So um, if there's still at least two or three in these 29 boxes. There's customs, bonus custom in a couple, at least two or three of the boxes. I think. Then I'll probably put two maybe in the, in the reload, depending on, you know, who I decide to go with the, with the jersey list, the licensed jersey, pick your players, and then I'll throw in a couple of customs that I have sitting around. So, you know, more more to you guys, you'll be able to grab a cheap spot, you know, five, six dollars, whatever it may be, and then you imagine you get, you know, licensed jersey and a, and a custom on top of that. So, you know, you know, more for you guys, bonus for you guys, you know, whether or not you love the customs or not, it's still nice to get an extra, extra autograph jersey. So, uh, so let's random for our spots here. Let's see. Get this done taken care of tonight. Let's see. Get my randoms. Get them up. Okay. Okay. 
So we're going to do our dice roll to five or more. Okay, 12. So 12 it is. So in there, it took out box number 20. That was the one that just hit. That was the Ender's Lee. So that's no longer in there. Um, that list. 20 is now gone. So there's just 29, 29 in there. So we'll do it 12 times. Okay, so do that. And then we'll take out the box and then we'll do do it again 12 times. So that'll be the keep it keep it uniform. So we'll do a 12 for the first box and 12 for the second box. So here we go. Two, no, it's a lot of rolls, but I mean I want to keep it consistent. I want there gonna be any kind of complaints about how many times you roll. You only rolled it three times. We did back to back after 12. It's really randomized. It doesn't matter either way, but there's always going to be somebody to throw in their two cents. So here's the box is going to be box 10. Box 10 is our first box. Okay, let's go back. Okay, let's move box 10. Okay, and we're going to do 12 again. Box, second box is going to be box 32. So box 10 and box 32. Okay. Flames of the Reload, Thomas. Let me think. Let me see if I have anything Calgary related. Uh, kind of. I mean, I do have a Matthew Kachuk Team USA. So he was on Calgary when he was on Team USA. But uh, that doesn't technically count as a Calgary jersey. Um I don't think I have anything else to Calgary wise. Nothing as of yet. You know, I'm always on the lookout for, for new stuff and I haven't been able to come across any any decent um Calgary jerseys I can add in there. But by all means definitely shoot me a text or an email and let me know if there's somebody you're specifically looking for. And I could, you know, definitely keep my my focus more narrowed on trying to find um any of those individual players. Like I said, I mean the huge names are gonna be tough because you know, there's you know, it's not easy to do with with you know, even even 40 random boxes of stuff to throw in, like a Gretzky or a McDavid or something like that. But I'm definitely trying to, you know, keep some good, you know, star players in there. I know, you know, I was just looking at the list of, you know, I, I was just looking at the list of uh, uh, the top 39 scores in the NHL this year. And it seems to be I have um, like 11 of the 39 scores either in this original load or in the, the potential reloads, including including three of the top five. You obviously, you know, Kucherov, Dryzado, and I do have a, a McKinnon for the, the reload. And then, you know, had the Matthew Kuchuk team, Jose, Ranton is already in there. So that's that's five of the top eight scores in the NHL this year. So, I mean, I, I like to have some, you know, retired players. Like I said, I do have that coffee, Pittsburgh, you know, Hall of Fame legend players going in there, but it's always good to have, you know, some solid, you know, current players. Um I have Brain Point. He was 14th in the league in scoring this year. And so he's going into the reload. So I mean, there's, you know, we just had we had Panarin that hit recently. And that was he was 17th in the league this year. And you know, I have Zach Hyman's in there. He was top 25. You know, I have his year that a junior's jersey from the Halifax uh Mooseheads, and that's going in. He was 30th. So I mean, it's good to have, you know, current, you know, scoring stars as well as you know, legends, Hall of Famers. I mean, it's good to have a little mix. Because, you know, like I said, new fans, it's good to get them exposed to the, you know, the all-time greats. I mean, even if, you know, some of them have been signing customs like crazy, it was nice to have that Chris Chelios license that we had in there. It's good to have that. Just, like I said, the majority of the Chelios you see right now is, is going to be custom stuff. So it was nice to get a, a licensed Chelios that somebody hit. Um, so there we go. So there's like boxes. Okay, we got box 10 and 32. Okay. Box 10 is here. Okay. Box 32 is on top of the pile. Oh, it goes down to. Okay. 
Travis Kanaki Adidas. Number 11, AJ COA. Nice there. T Kanaki, current star for the Philadelphia Flyers. Very nice. And their electric arm. Nice. Adidas Flyers jersey. That's good. Good. That's good. Okay. Not gonna go. That's one. Box thirty-two. We have so T connect me. Box thirty-two is going to be. Yeah, <laughs> very nice jersey. Yeah, very good. Glad we got McKinnon coming in. Miko Rantanen, Fanatic COA, very good, very nice Rantanen. Very good, Miko, Fanatic, very good, I think that, I'm not sure if they're kidding, I think it's a, going in is going to be a Fanatic, so there we go, Miko Rantanen and Travis, Connect me. Two very nice hits tonight. Very good. Very good. Let's see who we got. Nico Rantanen. Travis Connect me. Let me look. Let me look. Nico. Travis Connect me is Chris. Congratulations again, Chris. It's going to be on a hot streak. Very good. And Nico Rantanen. Dwayne Fox. He's been a regular. Purchaser or a bidder of the Miko Rant in this box. So, congratulations to Chris and Dwayne. Two very nice hits. Very, very nice. Congratulations. Like I said, we're down to the 27 boxes. So, we're getting down to the, the nitty gritty. It's nice to see some of you guys, some of the hits you guys have been gunning for. So, it's really nice. Congratulations, Dwayne. I don't think it would be your first or your second hit. But uh, Chris, has, Chris has been hitting. He obviously had the hit before with the with the um, uh, with the, uh, the the Anders Lee, so definitely two nice Adidas back to back for, for Chris, and then obviously that that Miko Rantanen was one that Dwayne was been gunning for. So, like I said, I'm going definitely. I mean, the hunt was decided for the Rantanen hit, but definitely the um, the the Nathan McKinnon is going to go in the reload. So, what I'm going to do for you guys, I'm going to post. I have pictures of all the reload jerseys. I'm going to put them on the Facebook page. So you get an idea. You'll see the COAs. You'll see the autographs. You'll see the style of jersey. You'll see, you know, the the, the autographs themselves. So you guys can have a better look. I mean, it's I put the, like the multiple pictures of the jerseys from the from the first group. So same thing. I just post all the jerseys. I'll probably do that tomorrow at some point. And then tomorrow also I'll have the jerseys already in bags. And then I'll do a video and post that on the the Facebook and the YouTube page. So you're going to see that. Just you know, obviously the one of the first couple. Videos on the YouTube page is me with the bags, the, the bag, the bagged up jerseys before I boxed them. So, uh, the same thing. I'll do up, at some point in time, I'll put that video up probably in the afternoon, but I'll probably put the 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 pictures up at some point in time early. If I'm not, I'm just maybe even do some tonight to get them up there. But um, the very last box from the original run, this original 27, um, will be a live uh, Facebook claim post on Tuesday at 8 p.m. Eastern time. Um, the prices won't change a whole lot, but, I mean, with these two jerseys gone, but I'll definitely put a preview spot price list up tomorrow. Um, then we'll have you guys to be able to spend your free time on your holiday checking out the preview spot prices, planning out your your uh, your angle of attacks for the spot clean post that goes up on 8 o'clock on Tuesday. So like I said, even if that fills, I probably don't want to break that until Friday anyway. But uh, Wednesday will be our, our framework box, no matter what. But if you guys want to keep grabbing spots, by all means, just, just post in the thread, you know, which spots you want. And then, you know, Ven Venmo or PayPal me the, the money for the spots. But that's definitely going to break on Wednesday. That's 100%. So that's my game plan for Wednesday. And then 
the the Facebook fill is going to go up for for Friday's break because that's going on Tuesday, Virgin Hour week. Um, and then, like I said, I'm posting also once the reload is in on Tuesday. I'm going to post the spots on eBay for another double box as a celebration of the reload boxes. So once we're going to go from you know 26 up to 41 or 42, those spots are going to be listed except for Marty Turgo because they won't let me post. For some reason, Turgo, but those spots are going to go up on eBay on Tuesday. You guys can bid on bid on them as your leisure. So that's those spots will end on Sunday and we'll break those two boxes as well. So congratulations on the double box in honor of my mom. She didn't care about Philly even when she lived here, and she was not a Colorado fan, but she knew I rooted for them back when Fopa and Saki and those guys played. So, but um, yeah, congratulations, two very nice hits. I'm happy to see anything hit, so I'm happy to see these nice ones definitely come out to you guys. So I'm um, looking forward to seeing you guys. Um, on, as well, you've seen my post before you see me, so definitely look forward to seeing you guys on Wednesday. But keep an eye out for the post. I'll be posting and and recording the video and posting and some more stuff. So everything will go up. On, keep an eye on the Facebook page, um, and you'll see all the information needed there. But thank you very much. I appreciate the support. And the input and the spending, and I couldn't do it without you guys. I'm always looking to get more stuff. So, so I will see you guys definitely back here on Wednesday. Enjoy your holiday. Yeah, I would like to get a hot on loop. How can loop? I probably get from home PC. I can't get a hot on loop. So the most roller correct has left the room because CK is on a hot streak now. So he's he he's he, I, don't, I, get, I don't have to take this out of my head. He doesn't need to put me in the bathroom anymore. Put him in the bathroom. So yeah, so those those are real nice hits. Like I said, congratulations, guys. So. Um, I'll definitely see you on Wednesday. Enjoy your holiday. Hopefully it's good weather wherever you are, but it's going to be decent weather here. I'm still tired from, from the, uh, I was up in West Point to see my nephew slash godson graduate at West Point. So that was a really fantastic experience. It was nice to be out there um, on the grounds in the stadium and then to see him individually get his, his bars, second lieutenant bar. So that was, that was a great experience. If anybody's ever been to West Point for the graduation ceremony, I'm all baked up. I'm sun. I'm, I'm, I'm lobster red. I'm. I feel like I have sunstroke from being out there in the sun and heat. Not a lot of shade on at West Point, but you know, it's in the, the mountains on the Hudson River. But uh, that was a great experience. Congratulations to him. I know we spent the night last night in New York at the at the, the Philadelphia Union game. Um, so that was that was experience for him. But he's back down here with his father. So, uh, so congratulations to him. Um, good time. Um, just let them know. Um, I will see you guys on Wednesday. Enjoy your enjoy your uh, holiday. Talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>